in this latest episode of Seti Nash Was Right. I think I said it about a couple of days ago. I said Lil Durk would drop that album in one to two weeks. And lo and behold, here we go. So, let's see the post, see my intro, and this is why y'all need to subscribe. Maybe I might know something and know somebody up over there. Possibly. But I'll reveal what's actually going on. Y'all ready? It's your favorite look, especially after I spoke. Support the real again. Get rid of the fake, the F you to the industry. How do you fight back? It's simple. All you got to do is just press subscribe, then join the movement over there on Instagram at C-E-D-D-Y-N-A-S-H. One word. That's for you and I can stay in contact. Plus, I'm going to like your pictures and all that. We have 75,000, so we done maxed. But when I can, I'm going to follow you back. To the crew, that's the truth. Right with the visionaries. Let's get into it. Oh, oh no, Seti Nash, you were right. You were so right. You want a cookie? Yeah, don't mind if I do. Mmm, shit. That's that macadamia. You sure was. Mm, no, you gotta be black to rock with this. Mmm. Need some milk? Hell no, I don't drink milk. Might drink your tears, though. Put that right. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so amidst the controversy and everything like that Lil Durk is about to drop his second album in a year Guaranteed to go number one Why? Because controversy sells <sighs> There's even a rumor That I might get name dropped in there I might have heard that from Lil Durk yourself It's possible I won't confirm but I will deny That ain't happening Listen, it's obvious Lil Durk has been media trained talk less, do more, that type of shit. And then when he do get on stuff, he don't really be saying nothing. Why? Because y'all got to understand something. You got to ride a wave until it die out. It just is what it is. Lil Durk would never be hotter than what the hell he is right now. It's impossible. And I told y'all, he got shit in the stash he's supposed to. And I told y'all what Lil Baby should do. I said Lil Baby should drop like a gospel album or a country album. It'll go number one. See, there's something I know that a lot of people don't know. Marketing, branding, and opportunity. Just, just think about it this way. In the last five days, this channel has grossed over 5,000 subscribers. And has done easily over 250,000 views. Do you think that was by mistake? No. It's because of people like you. See, what ends up happening is, you understand what we're doing. And then I'll be teaching y'all some shit that I know a couple of y'all be writing down like, ooh, all right, let me try that. Now, there's going to be, oh, well, Lil Durk is snitch. He's a rat and all that. I'll break that down later. I'll, I'll destroy that whole entire theory later, like, easily. But let's do this. Lil Durk. It's supposed to drop an album. Y'all like, oh, he got all this controversy and all that and everything like that. In the midst of all the bullshit, you got to seem unscathed. And when you seem unscathed and it seems like nobody can mess with you, it's because it's all on the internet. See, one of the things I know that Lil Durk does is turn off the internet. But believe what y'all want to believe. I told y'all he was going to drop the album. He needed to drop the album. He told y'all he was going to drop the album. Just never told y'all when. And I knew, I effing knew, he had it already put up and he needed drama. <laughs> Matter of fact, I think that's what it was. Lil Durk needs drama to sell his album. And voila, we'll see. This happens. I called it because I understand. Because I know. And for the new subscribers, bro, y'all in for, whoo. Y'all in for a goddamn ride. For the original 60. Man, thank y'all for rocking with me. But I'm going to reveal some shit tomorrow. That y'all going to sit back and go, oh, damn. So make sure you got your notifications on. Because what I'm about to say is going to blow back a lot of people's minds. And yeah, it's going to get some little pushback. But it is what it is. I'm always, I won't say I'm always right. But I pretty much hit on a lot of shit. Let's do it. 
Y'all expect me to keep it real? Because you know that I will. I do this daily, baby. Check out the Nightly Nash podcast. Also, Street the Music, Setty Nash, if you have not. It's on all streaming platforms. Guaranteed you're going to find something you like. Probably like that overly thugging freestyle. Or maybe something different. Let me know in the comments. We possibly shoot that music video.